Hey guys, Kronos here today, and we're going to be doing another quest playthrough. Yes, we saw how much you guys liked uh, a Maskets Evil Dave playthrough, so yes, we will continue to be doing these. Today, I'm going to be doing, very obviously, the Genome Project, the Christmas event quest. Um, I know this isn't a permanent quest, I know there were some talks about keeping it, but I don't believe it's going to happen. Um, I've heard some pretty poor reception to this quest, which is not great, but I've been fairly blind to the plot and everything, so I've been out of town the past couple days and have not been able to see anything. Um, so yeah, I'm going to be doing this now, and we should be recording our thoughts on pod podcast for that uh, later tonight, I think, actually. So, but yeah, let's just kick it off. Uh, before we get started, yes, I do have all the required items for this quest. It's not me using a guide or anything, it's just right here in the required item section. Just how I like to play quests, I like to be ready for stuff like that. Alright, so let's get this started. Queen of Snow. Is the going for this year? Oh, also, like, thanks, playthrough, I'm not going to just constantly read everything, but I will constantly comment, I guess. Everything's on hard blue. Okay, hold on. Let's have a let's have a little comment here. Everything is always wrong with you guys. You suck at Christmas. Does anything ever go right with you? Anyway, I Santa. Uh oh, that's right. They're a couple. I forgot about that. It's obviously been a while since they've shown up, so. And their child is Jack Frost, I think. Oh, yep, there it is. Lack of children in Gilinor? There's plenty of children. Creating the perfect child. Um, I believe it's sugar, spice, and everything nice. <laughs> There's a lot wrong with Jack. Wait, did we really just say 2004? Oh, that's not good. Rudolph has gone. Has Rudolph been in a... Christmas quest before? I don't ever seem to remember him being in that. The gnome copters. Ah, if anyone remembers those. For lapping the Grand Vizier. So Orla, Doc, and Aubrey. Really? What do these characters have in common? Hmm. 
So he's wanting to use divination to bring the gnome thing to life. Yeah, we know why you haven't used magic. See, now Doc makes sense, because he's trying to make a clockwork gnome, right? And you would think you'd need to know how to smith something like that? I don't know. Aubrey, I assume, is going to be the magic that puts them together. Makes sense to me. Nicholas? Nick? Nicholas? So he went to Doc to learn how to smith it, went to Aubrey to try to figure out the magic, and then decided that he needed divination from Orla? Okay. Into a real boy. Oh jeez, this is a Pinocchio thing. Ugh. Yes, I do actually have a very distaste for the Pinocchio movies. Fight me. Cando Master Smith. Yeah, I can't possibly imagine who that is. I guess that makes sense why we need a red berry pie then. So we're gonna be going to Thurgo, aren't we? Wait, is our player really acting like we don't know who Thurgo is? What? I mean, I understand this doesn't have any requirements, but. I mean, we've done things with Thurgo multiple times. At least three right off of memory. Okay. I would have liked some dialogue if we had actually, you know, done it, but I guess if this is... whatever. Not a big deal. Oh boy. Although I'm not seeing what everyone's complaining about so far, but I guess I am like two steps in the quest. Talk about Santa. Nicklaus, why are they using this name? Was that ever said to be his name before? Like, I get it, it's Nicholas and Claus, Nicklaus. That's weird. Hold the gnome in front of the Black Dragon Queen's flame breath? What? It works for royal crossbows? You're not bringing the royal crossbows to life! <laughs> what? <laughs> I... I'm not sure how the connection was made of Take a clockwork gnome and hold it in front of fire, and it'll bring it to life. Okay. Where was the entrance? It's just up here, isn't it? It's been a while since I've been there. Do, 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 do. Oh, well, okay then. Did he 
he ride his sleigh in here? We're underground. Oh, that horrible camera. Ugh. It's really low on that. What? We were back inside the queen. What do you think? Oh. Oh. I didn't even. Is that there on my way in? Yes, you are a fool. Oh, Rudolph got burned to smithereens. Huh. Interesting. It's an interesting piece of music they're playing. Oh man, oh I should have talked to the clockwork comp. Ah! right now. Woohoo, that looting. Santa smells fun. Is that all you have to say? Okay then. Oh. Anomalies will appear. They will destabilize the energy source. This is not good. You can seal anomalies while continuing to channel the rift as long as you concentrate. I need you to demonstrate your ability to seal 15 anomalies without breaking your connection to the rift. Anomalies are bad. Channel the rift. Okay. Wow, I am standing really far away from this. Jesus Christ. What is this giving me XP on? Anomalies. Just get to it. No seal. 15 anomalies. It should start appearing when you channel it. Oh, okay. What am I looking for? Where? Uh... Oh, I see. Oh, wow, that's really... Okay. Exciting gameplay. Okay, so how is this... So I've got some questions here. Magic Rift is going to bring this Clockwork home to life. Okay, I mean... We've established that that's not how life works before, but I'm um, okay. It's it's an event. I'm not gonna worry that much about it. 
going to see how this plays out first. Why do we need 15 of these? Because they don't spawn super rarely. Although I'd like to know what it's PM. Is it crafting? Yes. Do, 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 do. Sorry about this. I know it's not exactly super exciting, but whatever. Got to do it. Five more. Yeah, I hope this recording comes out well. I was the one that was originally planning on recording uh, Evil Dave, but I had to find a new way to record my screen. So OBS is not going to work for Rinsky. Just not. Drops way too many frames. Alright. Gonna knack for that, yes. What? Does it make sense for a tune mat? For 10 fewer, 10 regular. Doesn't work. It's going to be capable of changing some. Alright, let's see how this goes. Wow, why is this so big? Santa still smells funny. Okay, so I guess that didn't do anything. Alright. Let's see, Doc, what do you want? It is an idea. <laughs> Wait, I need the pale energy for him? I assume that was gonna be for Thorla. Er, Thorla. Uh, Orla. If Thorla is a player. Keep the generator from full parts. Power right up, see if it's level. Okay. Well then, let's see what happens. What is There are quite a bit less puzzles in this than I assumed there was going to be. Usually, uh, holiday events have a lot of puzzles in them. Maybe Orla has one, who knows. So when the smoke happens, keep repairing it, you'll eventually see panels start to smoke. Just be careful. What? Keep repairing it, you'll see it smoke. Okay, what do I do? Oh, that's the XP. Oh, press control panel. Test on us. Special invention, good. Jesus, why does this keep getting? What? 
Just that. I love how we had to go from one cutscene to another. I would so love for the stupid gnome thing to like become evil or something and attack Santa. That'd be hilarious. Seems not, but he didn't even do anything. Is he still just gonna say Santa smells weird? Oh, I am fine. That was funny. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Well, Thorla. Got Thorla. Rather unorthodox trait. So she's gonna convert the lobsters through like transmogrifying or something? Trade them with the gentleman on the Caribbean desert. Meet you east of a card upon the sky. strike one plus hit. Lobsters are a del delicacy in office. Okay. Oh, all right then. Uh, when did lobsters become a delicacy in Nenefos? Was that ever said? Anywhere? Okay. There's something that was pitched as a funny holiday event. I've Yet to see anything really funny. I mean, even Evil Dave had a bit, of, you know, some humor that worked, but they haven't even like made jokes, puns, or anything. All right, where is the guy? Is it you, Strike Marm Hunter? Uh, probably not. Oh, I'm in effect. There we go. So long. When did that get here? No, that hasn't always been here. Contains the energy of countless trap souls. Hmm. Why did one from Minifos just appear over here? That's weird. Was Aura up over here? Oh, I see what's about to happen. He's going to try to use the soul obelisk for the stupid thing. And they didn't want to use Metaphos for this. I got it, I got it. You take, just take the whole obelisk. She's just going to teleport it? What? Uh. Okay. Doc, you look horrible in low poly mode. Where did it go? Did she just like hide it? Is it in your ass? Probably. <laughs> That's pretty accurate. <laughs> a 
Okay, that's funny. <laughs> I think Orlo, that's still Christmas. Mostly deactivated and will only work when channeled directly. How do they manage that? The channel the obelisk, it's not even here. Oh, oh, there it is. It's hiding with the pillars. Hello. Wow, stay still. Oh, come on. Wow, this is not very responsive. No, oh, come on. No, I didn't click you to go over the son of a bitch. They're gonna make me start it. Wow, this clicking is not responsive. Ooh. You feel the yes. Funny that it didn't give that, like, super black and white effect that it does in Miniface. That would have been nice. Oh, we donated part of our soul to the obelisk. Well, I can't see that going anywhere. Well, maybe we'll get Sliske inside the stupid dome. That'd be funny. It's not going to happen, though. If this doesn't work, I mean, come on, nothing will, right? Really? It feels stupider. I mean, we are pretty ignorant sometimes. Okay. They'll just say sand smells. Yes. Okay. I'm still unsure what Santa is trying to accomplish from all of this. Oh, did you not tell her that Rudolph was ashes now? in the clockwork gnome with the phoenix. Are they just going to take us there? Because that's not a member's area and this is free to play, so it's got to be. Yep, looks like it. This is supposed to be in parts, isn't it? It's like chapters, like the penguin one was a couple years ago. It doesn't, unless this is all one chapter, but I can't imagine them making it this long. Talk to Santa. Oh. Hmm. 
Well, if you've never been a member before, here you go. Just the phoenix right in front of you. All right. Even if you haven't done the quest, she's supposed to be dying. Since when are you the bringer of joy? Being of magic, huh? It's just a reindeer, though. Ritual of rebirth. I'm gonna teach Xlara in this. Rudolph Reborn. We just got fire. This is surely Rudolph. We. Wait. Oh, he's flying. Oh, yeah, he's got fire. I also talk to myself in the third person. <laughs> yes, please let's not start that again. magic. <laughs> Melting point of steel is actually very high. I can't possibly see this going well. Although maybe he'll get fire wings too. why he thought the phoenix would be able to do that. Although I definitely want a flaming Rudolph pet. A fire flap creature. That does bring up an interesting question though. Can the phoenix just reborn anyone from ashes? Oh hey, he's got a pet. I guess it does become a pet then. Uh, Doing them simultaneously. All right. Oh, not you again. This seems like a poor idea. Did we have to donate more of our soul? Is it or is Orla actually gonna like do her job this time?
did it did it turn him from a clockwork into like an actual gnome? Uh, he's got skin. Well, that's weird. Kind of creepy. Although I do like this updated model. How do you feel? Local cautions. That's never a good thing. You can feel everything. Cross companion, black and white Christmas snowboards. All access to scaling activity is in rock exchange. Oh, it's another one of these. You know, we keep getting these snowboards, and they're never useful. At least this one we can actually wear. I know there were some events that it was like, oh, you can only use this on the slope, and the slope goes away, so now we have a useless item. Okay. All right, well, I guess this didn't have chapters. Yeah. Weird. Heard it had four. All right. Well then, guys, this has been the Genome Project. So, as for general thoughts on it, I mean, it was it wasn't bad. It's definitely not the best Christmas event by any means, but you know, it honestly it felt like here's some people that you remember, and oh look, haha, remember them? Like, the Queen Black Dragon scene, it, other than the joke of Rudolph's dead, I, I didn't see much of a point to it. Um, I don't know, this is going to be one I'm going to have to think about, and you know, you're definitely going to get our full thoughts on it in the podcast, but yeah, I mean, this was... Uh, pretty low down there on Christmas events for me, especially for a quest that was even contemplated about being, you know, staying. Honestly, I can see this one just going and me not having that much of a problem with it, unlike the Halloween event, which would have stayed, but that's besides the point. So, yeah, that was it. Uh, we should be having our podcast coming up at the same time that this goes up. So make sure to check that out on the channel, and until next time, see you later!